I'm joined here by Fergal Hagerty, who's the manager of the Annie Kilimona team, and they've had an emphatic win over Tulla in the Championship. Uh, Fergal, a week is a long time in politics, to say, and, and in Hurland the same way, because you've turned uh, a, a big defeat last weekend, in the, albeit in the league, into a huge victory here today. Yeah, I suppose we were hoping we'd get a reaction from last week. Um, we were very disappointed with last week, the way we performed. It was, you, if we had performed or beaten, you take something out of the game, but there was, there was very little to take out of it in terms of positives. So, you know, we sat down the lads, we did very little uh, physical work this week. We just kind of teased things through and fairness, the players had a meeting on Sunday morning and we had a meeting with them afterwards. And, you know, we said we'd, 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 we'd up our performance and uh, I think, you know, we did that today. We're yeah. delighted. I, I could say that the last Saturday's performance is forgotten now because the, the, this display, in particularly the second half display, was just a fantastic run. Uh, James O'Hollan came up there with six points. I mean, that's yeah. an amazing. You, you, give, you put faith in him, you gave him his chance, and, and he's repaid just today. Yeah, look, it was, it was a temptation last, from last week to kind of change things dramatically, but you know, we, we had performed very well in the league and we got to a league final, so it's important to remember that. And you know, we were conscious of, we'd given fellas. An opportunity to the league, and if you turn around, then just because you're beaten in the final and, and, and make wholesale changes, I think that wouldn't have been the thing to do. So, yeah, look, there was a number of players there that we paid their fate today, and but delighted for them. Yeah, and great. Uh, we hadn't chased today, so it made it all, it all, all the better. Aiden came up with four points, nine had to, I think, he had two from play, David Miskel, two from play, Evan chipped in with a pint, and two from Jolly Arthur. That's a great return. I'm just having a quick look at here. That's a great yeah. return from, from, from the forwards and midfield. Yeah, look at our forwards. We have, we, we have a lot of talent up there if they, if they get the right ball into them. Maybe last week we were guilty of maybe shooting on sight from, from impossible angles and not walking the ball in. But today we walked the ball in and, and uh, it worked for us today. Uh, we might walk every day, but it's not. It certainly yeah. works. And our backs were fairly mean as well. They, they gave away very little, uh, a fortuitous goal just after half time, and that was answered almost straight away. Yeah, look, we, it was, that was a big body blow. We were eight points up at half time, but there was a very strong reason. If you look at all the games we played today, I know the likes of San Lara were eight up at half time, your own were up a good bit at half time, but all those games finished very closely. So, eight points, while it was a, you know, it was a nice lead, it, wasn't, it was by no means over at half time, and then you can see the goal after half time. And, this was the, that's the pleasing thing. We reacted very well to that, that goal and we wiped it out fairly quickly. Yeah, I, I know that you have, you have yourself and the lads there, you've put huge effort into, into this team since way back in, 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 the, in the midst of uh, winter. Like, and, and I think to, today, like, that, you could see the work that's been done, you could see, especially in that second half performance, was, was flawless. Yeah, look, we won't be getting carried away with it either, but we have a lot of work done early on here with fitness and with a lot of work done in the gym. And, so, you know, it's just disappointing them when you don't perform like we did last week. But, you know, today is one of the good yeah. days, but it's still only our first round. And, uh, you know, we, we'd be ambitious yeah. enough that we'd, we'd take it on another step and it's all about yeah. the draw now. Yeah, Kilmele went down today, Remarkable went down today. I, I, I didn't get the rest, the rest of the results haven't come in just yet. Yeah. But there's going to be Bellier or Clooney Quinn. So the, you're avoiding big teams. Well, you're avoiding them in the losers group, but you won't avoid them in the winners. Yeah. You know? So the next day... Uh, Look, every day you go out, it's pressure because you want to win, and you do all that training since January. Whether it's in a loser's group or winners, we want to perform, and we want to perform the next day. That's yeah. that's that's going to be all about now for the next two weeks. Yeah, you've really lifted the the, the whole spirit. Like the, the supporters going out there and are absolutely thrilled yeah. with the way you played and performed. So yeah. I'd have to say, well done, and that's good. Well, thanks. Look, it's nice when you perform. As I said, the lads have put in a lot of effort. Their families have put in a lot of effort. That sacrifice. When you perform well, we'll enjoy it and, and look at we prepared for the next day and see how it goes. Absolutely. I suppose you'll stop off on the way at Cusick Park on the way home. Right. We'll stop somewhere <laughs> in All right, thanks. Thanks, for it. thanks.